Tuesday morning. Uh, we just pull up to the shop, eight o'clock. I'm gonna get a warm up in, and then we're heading out to the track. Tuesdays are usually um, the bigger days. Uh, you kind of have you get your longer motos in this time, and then um, you know the rest of the week's kind of easy just to recover for Saturday. But yeah, um, got I'm gonna do a triple crown format today since that's the race this weekend. And so I'm gonna kind of just mimic race day. Just do a warm up and then three mains with starts. And then, um, yeah, I mean, obviously keep working on the little things that I've been been needing to do. Um, I mean, everyone kind of has their weaknesses, but I kind of go to the track every day with a plan of, you know, attacking those and, and getting better. So, you know, that's the plan. And then, yeah, after that, we'll get some gym work in and then yeah, that's it. So, let's see how today goes. Uh, just doing a little race prep for the for the race bike for this weekend for uh, Glendale. Just getting right now, I'll grab a new plastic and everything for it, and then get a. Uh, I'll get graphics and everything here in a bit, and then get it all put on when we get back from the track today, and then. Yeah, not a whole lot going on. He's, yesterday I got everything cleaned on the race bike and everything, so when we get done practicing today, I can, when we get back, I can start building. I think it gets uh, full disassembly, like everything gets pulled apart. Um, we usually do new plastics every weekend, and then sometimes a new seat cover every weekend. New tires, new chain, everything gets disassembled. The calipers get pulled apart, inspected, cleaned. And then uh, especially after a crash, just want to make sure everything's okay. And make sure there's nothing of the ordinary, make sure the bike's good and safe. Just going through the motions, taking to the corner or not. Yeah. You're going hard, so. Still, it's going to be hard to break in with just two guys. Have you do like four laps or something? It'd just be short, yeah. Okay. Want to make a lap time on you? So you have an idea? Yeah. Okay. Like the last two laps do it? Like the last two or something. But okay. I'll just feel it out. Okay. Let's do a nice two start. Yeah. No footer was even better. Oh, <laughs> ah, no footer was good. Did you see him? Oh, he did both legs way out. Really? Yeah.
Not too bad. You know, start the time. Start the 10 minutes once they go. No, oh, I got it. <laughs> I mean, like, you're alive. There's just a bunch of people up there. I almost went to the triple where we've done that, but. We can find a spot up there whenever it's busy. Just go off the side talk. You know? Yeah. That was good though. Like the front here. Like the H1 hats. Yeah, so you can stand down the hole. Like, no, yeah, I'll just down right there. <laughs> I'd be like. Like, just look down. Yeah. Like right there. Yeah, that was way good though. That was good. Yeah. I can see it. It's funny. I can tell, like, just in your eyes, if you're shooting, you're charging. Yeah. You look pissed. <laughs> yeah. Oh, not a whole lot. Just getting the race bike all ready and prepped. While we we're at the track, the engine guys were able to get the motor done and everything, so. Once we got back from practicing, I was able to just grab the motor and throw it in, and now going together with the wiring harness and everything, yeah, it's going good. 
Uh, it's not. It's not too bad. I mean, I can just if I gotta work late, and I can, I can work late. Like I was here till midnight last night working on it, and I'm perfectly fine with it. It's if I gotta stay late just to get the bike done. It's it's not an issue. Yeah, especially where I go to the track with Christian, then come back, and then have to work on this, and then go to the track again. Uh, some days we have guys fill in, like on Thursday when I fly out, when the other guys will fill in for me while he's practicing. But uh, while we're doing a little bit of testing today and everything, I was wanting wanting to be there and everything for that. And then, uh, but yeah, it's a uh, it is a lot of we put all of us. I, think, uh, I speak for the whole team when I say this that we just this is this is our life. This is this place. The day went pretty good actually. It was. Uh super solid day. The track ended up being better than we thought. The track was pretty dry and just not a lot of stuff to it yesterday. And so they threw down a lot of water last night and ended up being really good. And then did the triple crown format with, with Joe and we did a start with each of them. <clears throat> I mean, couldn't have asked for a better day. It was, uh, we were both riding super good. I felt um, really aggressive on the bike and was just hitting my mark, so I was happy with that. And now we're on the way to, to pick up Jagger. He gets out of school at three and it works out perfect sometimes. You know, when I'm doing my work, it's, you know, it's strictly just all about that. So gonna, you know, take the rest of the day to hang out with the family and we'll probably go do something, go out to dinner or something. And, you know, the past two days have kind of just been wide open for me. So now it's time to shift the focus to them um, kind of like use the afternoons when you can and nights and not, you know, beat up yourself too much. Obviously, like get off your feet and you don't want to wear yourself out. But <clears throat> the kids are there, you know, they want to they wanna go have some fun. So the focus is on them. It's not about me anymore. Um, so we're going to pick up Jagger right now and, yeah, we'll probably take him to do something. But other than that, it was a good day and, yeah, hopefully you guys like this video.